This video is how to auto dub. Okay, so first thing you're gonna do, you're gonna record your spot and you're gonna save it just like you always do in the commercial master, wide orbit, format right, 44 100 hertz, stereo 16 bit, that all looks good. Click okay, yep. So once you got that done, go to your PO. Up here on the top right corner of the PO, it says add file. You're gonna click that, file type, Final spot, choose file, and I've got my spot right here ready to go. You can double click it, or you can even drag and drop. If you've got it open in your Adobe Audition, you can drag that over as well from there. So once that's in, click submit. Now once that's in, you go to these little double arrows here. It's expanding a player right? And you want to put in your out cue. If you don't remember what that is, you can play here. I'm Chandel Bennett. I'm in your star at Woodland Terrace. So if you're looking for a great place to work or live, call either location or check us out on our website at seniorstar.com. Seniorstar.com. Save. So now that's done. So over here, you go from your needs production, you're going to click this drop down and change it to needs dubbed. Now you don't need to worry if there's a cart number in here or not. You don't need to worry about anything over here. And as a matter of fact, this dubbed area, leave that blank. Because if there is anything in here, if there's anything in this drop dropdown, uh, AutoDub is going to think, hey, somebody else is gonna do something with it. I don't need to do anything. So just leave that blank. Everything else is ready to go. Uh, and once the AE or whoever clicks spot approved, this should kick on over. Re click refresh and you should get a new message, auto dub message. It's just another quality control thing. If everything looks correct over here, it's the right length and everything, you just click reset. After, it even says, after this is fixed, verify, click the reset button to auto dub the spot. Everything looks right, click reset. I'm just gonna refresh again, make sure that is no longer there. And we're good to go. Now this should auto dub on its own. You're done. That's it. If you have any questions, let me know.